Look at the front where it says Ames real big. Well, everyone, we've done it again. Another Bucky. You know how much I love this place. This place puts a big smile on my face. I absolutely love coming here. It's not in Texas, no. It's not even in Kentucky or Tennessee. This time we're in Florence, South Carolina. Holy cow. I can't wait to get in there and see it for myself and share it with you guys. And you obviously know what I want in there. A brisket sandwich. So we're going to get that too. But what are we waiting for? The weather out here is kind of crappy. But in there, everything makes me happy. Except the amount of people. <laughs> but that's what happens when you have an awesome place like this. So let's go in there and see the beautiful wonderland of Bucky's of Florence. All right, let's go. Let's do it. Oh, yeah. I know I'm going to need a cart for this. They still got the sport cabana that I've wanted for a long time. One of these days I'll get it. But you know what? It's been, it's been an interesting start to 2023. Here we go. Let's start something new. Wow, look at the gas price up there. We're definitely going to hit that up. Valentine's Day. Look at that. Maybe not for me, but maybe it is for you. What do you guys think? Cool, huh? I love it. Very cool. They even have them for the little ones here. Look at the little kids' shirts. And check out the the, the bows. Jeez. Look at the little socks. Wow, it's that loud. The bibs. <laughs> Ain't that cool. Look, they even have the Valentine's Day coloring and activity book. They even have the little crayons to go with it. How cool is that? 74 cents for eight crayons. Not too bad. Their prices, yeah, they can charge whatever they want and I'll go and fall for it and buy it. The prices aren't too bad on things. We start off on the food side. They got the snacks. These are so good, by the way. I've had these a few times. Really good stuff. Obviously, you can't go wrong with the beaver nuggets. I already texted my manager at work. She wants a bag, so we're going to get her that. And I'm going to get myself a few, too. The white cheddar is good. The bold and spicy is really good. They're not even really that hot. But anyway, what are we doing? Let's go look around. This place is packed. This place is packed full of people. People everywhere. It's what happens on a weekend. Whew. Okay, now that we got some room. Oh, by the way, guys, I tried this back in the winter time, back in Christmas time, from uh, the Fort Worth location. This is really good. I might actually pick up a bag of that too. I might. And I can tell you, I'll eat the whole thing in one day. It really is that good. And I have that big of a problem with it. So, Anyway, let's continue the video so I can do some shopping. So you got all your candy on the candy wall here. This one's laid out significantly different than the other ones I've been to. It kind of reminds me of the Melissa one. Because you got the food on this side. And you got doors down there on the other side. I know it's hard to see, but you got the gift shop down that way. Let's see. I, I got a look, too. It ain't Bucky's if they don't have Shiner. I know we're in South Carolina, but, I mean, come on. You have to. And I don't see it. That's, that's a bummer. But that's okay. I got it the other day at Food Line, being down here. <laughs> but anyway, let's continue on the tour. They got just about everything you would imagine for all the Bucky's that we've been to. Uh, they got their icy machine back there. If I can get back there. Let's go. Oh, look at the bottle koozies. Very cool. Ooh, I just broke it. I'm not even in here. Five minutes and I'm already breaking stuff. That's all right. That's one for the blooper reel, but I'm keeping it in the video anyway. Let's continue. <laughs> You know, these chips have always been really good. I wasn't too wild about the pork rinds. I tried them before. I think I got the habanero ones down in uh, the temple location, but I wasn't too wild about them. But the other ones are good. The, the, the buckos are good. I know my mom liked these. I like these ones. The hot and jalapeno, the barbecue, they're all very good. But whatever you like, they have regular, classic, salt and vinegar, you name it. Yeah, there's the ricey station there. And you know what's coming up behind that. They got coffee, and where is it? The sweet tea. It's around here somewhere. Sweet tea, right back there. We'll hit that up in just a minute. I want to look around first, but there's the, the best. <laughs> All righty, let's try and maneuver through this place. This place is insane. 
It's a weekend, though. That's going to happen. So we just got to go around and do it. Oh, God. Here we go. At the Texas Roundup. There they are. There they are. We'll get that in a minute. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. I want to see the gifts. Kolaches. We're going to get one of those, too. They got... They got all kinds of sweets here. The fudge is really good. I do like the fudge. I got one of these before. Very good. Really like that a lot. But I want to get back there if we can. It's so jam-packed full of people. It reminds me of the Tennessee location and the Richmond one. But that's what happens. And the cookies. Oh, this place knows the way to my heart. Well, that didn't take long at all. I even turned my hat around because look who's behind me. Bucky. And I got my picture with him, obviously. So... There's that. The truck full of Bucky's. I love I've seen really big ones here. Somebody has a really big one somewhere in their cart. But, you know, I got one of those. I just I wonder how much the giant one costs. I'm sure it's a couple hundred bucks. <laughs> but, yeah, check out the truck, too. They even have the sticker in it that says Bucky's and everything. Pretty cool. Anyway, let's continue on. Now we're back in my favorite department, the souvenir section. Every part of this place is my favorite. No worries. I love it. And I saw this online, the new tour shirt. If you remember, I got the old one, the 2021, and that's also a new shirt too. I love it. <laughs> don't know which one I'm going to get. Obviously, I'm going to get one, but which one I don't know. Look at all this. Saving the world from ordinary. They got the popper too. That's funny. Beaver believer. Very cool. See, I see all the magnets on here. I actually wonder if they have the ones, the metal ones like I got from the Texas locations. I tried to get them from the ones in Richmond, Kentucky, and the one in Cross or Tennessee, whatever. Crossville, I think. They're building another one in Tennessee and another one in Kentucky. And this little football. I have one of those. It's awesome, but it just rips, so I'm, I'm going to pick up one of those. I don't see the metal one, which kind of sucks, but, oh boy, it's going to get expensive. Do I want a new pillow for my couch? I think I do. I think, I'm, I think it's time. <laughs> Check out the jackets they have here, too. Kind of like the pattern one. I mean, I would never wear this, but obviously, but I do like that. That is pretty cool. And here we go for the ladies. Oh, check out the pants they have, too. Tie-dye. Very cool. They have the sweatshirts that go that go with it. Like that one there. Pretty cool with the blue. And then back here, go little rock star. <laughs> Shorts are flashy. There's that one up there. Easily distracted by dogs and buckies. Yep, you got that right. They got the windbreaker jackets back here. Bucky's snacks and naps. The shorts. Oh, here's some more shirts. Oh, yeah, there's the brisket sandwich shirt again. They got the tour one. <sighs> I just don't know. Okay, we've seen that one. What's this? Buckle up with Bucky. Oh, yeah, for your seatbelt so the belt doesn't irritate your neck. Very cool. That pillow up there is actually really cool. I love that. It's vapor and everything. That's pretty cool. Uh, it might be an expensive day. It usually is. The hell am I talking about? Every time I come to Bucky's, it's an expensive day. <laughs> That's just how it is. Check out the beanie. Rec recognize that? Yep, love that thing. Very warm in the winter time too. And I think it was like twelve bucks or something. I can't remember, but really like that a lot. Check out these stickers I hadn't seen before. Obviously, you're not going to see them anywhere but here. The South Carolina ones. It's the Beaver Nuggets for me. That's really cool. I like that one, but I really like this one here. Very cool. This one kind of goes with my shirt, with the theme. I mean, it's a different pattern, but you get the idea. So 90s. <laughs> they have Bucky's Fun Straws. My God, look at this. That's that's hilarious. So it makes you look like you have Bucky's face. <laughs> and they got the Christmas ornaments still. I'm glad that they carry them. They have Bucky's kites too. Very cool. Yeah. Let's see what we got down here too. They got... Okay, there's, I don't think there's anything on that. Oh, yeah, just a little logo down there on the pocket. That's cool, though. Um, what else? I'm trying to... It's so hard to see anything in here because of how many people are in here. But, oh, they even got Yellowstone stuff. Good. Really fell in love with that show. And, you know, it, I still like it. So, and check this out. 
Look at these pillows. They got the, the ones that match the shirt for Valentine's Day. Very cool. I just wish they were a little softer. I mean, they're nice, but I wish they were a little bit softer. But they're very cool. Oh, and uh, oh, wow. Look at that shirt there. That one's cool. I have obviously the Texas ones. I got a couple of those, but they have that. Living my best life, South Carolina. Bloom where you are planted. I try. I, I really try. And love the Christmas ornaments, the South Carolina ornaments. They even have the keychain. Look at that. Let me zoom in. There, now it's a little bit clearer. Very cool. They have more over here, too. Oh, check out these ones here. They don't have them on display, though. These are youth shirts, though. The Destination shirt, though. Florence, South Carolina. That's a cool color. Um, look at this one here. I like, the, I like the colors on it. They have the youth size. Um, these are just youth shirts, too, but I do like the... I love the colors on that. I wish that was in an adult size. I would probably grab that. The lunch boxes. That... I love that. I just love that style. And just like every other Bucky's location we've been to, they have their massive gift shop in here with something for everyone. They got all the mugs here. They got all the Yellowstone stuff here. Outdoors, fishing, camping, you name it. They got the shoes, the flip-flops. It's awesome. It's just, you know, no matter what happens... This place brings me a lot of joy. It's different, but it brings me a lot of joy. And I ain't stopping. Love the Kohler tote with the speaker with the logo on it. Bucky. Very cool. I just love that 80s, 90s theme to it. Even these Kohler bags. Now, if you remember, I mean, these ones are great because you could fit a whole case of beer or, or soda or whatever you want in there. You could fit a whole lunch. Camo ones are cool. The little lunchbox are cool. But if you remember, I got this one here. I love it. It's perfect for a day trip to anywhere, like to a beach, a park, anything. You could fit enough drinks and food in there for well, for definitely two people. Maybe for four, it's a little small. But for two people, definitely. So if you need a bigger bag, that's what you got there. And those ones up there as well. Very cool, though. And, oh, yeah, guys. I bought this. The hammock. I haven't tried it out yet, but it's one of the Yukon Outfitter hammocks, and I'm gonna show you guys me setting it up and give you guys a product review on it. And no, I'm not getting sponsored or anything like that. I just want to show you that. I've always wanted one of these hammocks. I think it'd just be really peaceful to do that, and it gives me an idea for a future rail fan video to set it up up near the Big Beaver area where I catch a lot of trains, set it up in the woodsy area by uh, Highland Crossing. And just relax on that while I wait for a train to come by. Once the weather gets warmer, obviously. This time of year, that, that wouldn't be too fun. Even though it's not too bad down here up in PA, it sucks. <laughs> but there's your gift shop here. They got toys for everyone. People of all ages, even me. Like, you know, I'm a kid at heart. Mad Libs. Gotta love Mad Libs. <laughs> Look at all this stuff here. Check this out. Myrtle Beach. Check out that shirt. Peace, Love, and Mardi Gras. Yeah, that's coming up very soon, too. It is February, after all. And, well, here's your general store that I tell everybody about. It's not just a tourist trap. I mean, it is. But they have all these cool goodies here. Kind of like your... How should I say? It, it, it reminds me of Cracker Barrel, but on steroids and so much better with so much more selection. I love that. Okay, Karen. <laughs> but as you can see, they have a wonderful store here. The candles are really good. I actually wonder if they have the candles from Texas in here. Oh, there's the air fresheners. Yep, Clyde, Texas. These things are fantastic. Got, got a few of these over the years. The star ones, yep, we've had this one. Really like that one a lot. Here's the Fredericksburg Farm Candles. Texas Handmade. 
Texas Handmade Goat Milk Soap. It's hitting me, <laughs> but everything's okay. These air fresheners, I always thought these were cool. Great for like a small room, like a closet or a bathroom anyway. And since we're so close to the beach, I like the nautical theme items here. I love this. Absolutely love this. Just don't know where I would put it. I do have a wall where I put my like beachy, summery themed items on. I could put it on that. That's very cool. We are very close to the beach, obviously, and we're obviously very close to a place that I love, my favorite place in the whole world. If it isn't Texas, it's the Outer Banks in North Carolina, but I'm quickly falling in love with South Carolina, too. So, holy cow. Look at the large bag of beef jerky. It's $20. Holy cow. Wow. Hot and spicy. That one's a good one, too. Oh, look at this. They got more beach theme items here. Look at this. This is awesome. Love it. Love the sea turtles. Always loved sea turtles. Got all kinds of wall art. Margaritaville. I've been to the one in Nashville. That place is great. <laughs> well, now that I've shown you all around this place, or as much as I could, the best I could, it's time for me to start spending. So I'm going to go grab a shopping cart because I know I'm going to be filling that up here very quickly. Obviously, I want a bag of this. This is the best beef jerky I've ever had in my life. Wait, where did all this come from? Guilty. Guilty as charged. Yep. And I ain't done. <laughs> I'll say this. This is a cool new hat. I haven't seen that one before. I've seen that one. You've seen that one. Obviously, everybody knows my hat that I got that I rarely ever see except at the Texas locations for obvious reasons with the Texas flag on it. Love it. But it's just weird that they don't have it here. Look at this one. That's wicked cool too. Love it. Check out that shirt. Bucky's is always a good idea. I agree. I like that. That's pretty cool. Oh, I just don't know. Do I like that one or do I like that one or do I like the... The brisket one. I really like that brisket one up there. That one's I like. I was wondering where the large buckies are. They got a bunch of them up there. I just wonder how much they are. That's really cool. I bet they're a lot of money, but that's pretty cool. They even have sweatpants. I, I don't can't remember if I showed you guys this. Because there's so many people I try to go around. They even have the onesies here. Oh my gosh. And they got the pillows here. The blankets. I always liked that one, but I don't care for it being a long sleeve shirt. I would like it better if it was a short sleeve, but oh well. They have these pillows here too. These are pretty cool. I want to get them for the couch. I just don't know which ones I want to get. Look at the birthday socks, the uh, anniversary stuff. If you remember, they had their 40th anniversary last summer. It was awesome. And I just love that they went with the theme. Like they have all the party theme items. They even still have the Christmas mugs here. I just, I love this. The the Bucky's napkins and everything. I need napkins for home, so like, how much? $2.98, what the heck? And they got, oh, look at these for the cupcakes. Love it, love it. And they got more over here, happy birthday. They even got the paper plates. Awesome. Oh, oh yeah, look what I just found. You know what that means. It's just so ridiculously good, it's just, just so Mwah. <laughs> all right so when i get a brisket sandwich that only means one thing what's the next thing i get after that go ahead put it in the comments below what's the next thing i get after a brisket sandwich every time every single time hmm? have you figured it out yet yep so cool every time every time wow just taking it all in i absolutely love this place look how crowded it is and it's one time i just don't care i love it i love coming here just, it's 
It's an amazing place. It brings me a lot of happiness. And I'm happy to bring you guys along with me. I love this place a lot. I love bringing you guys along with me for the ride. Despite everything. I love it. I always have, ever since the first time. And that will never change, no matter what. Bucky's, my happy place. No matter what, I'll always love this place and go to as many of them as I possibly can. I promise. All right, well, that wraps up another trip to another Bucky's. Really happy to come out here to this one in South Carolina. Beautiful place, love it. I love it, obviously. They have a lot of fuel pumps here. As a matter of fact, let me show you. Yeah, they have a lot of fuel pumps here, <laughs> double row. Actually, I need to get gas too, so we're gonna stop over at a pump so I can fuel up. But yeah, tons, but that's how it is. Anyway, I'm really glad you guys could join me today and uh, come out here so we could check out this Bucky's. I really love it. You know, it's different, but I like it. It's my happy place. Gone to Bucky's. <laughs> anyway. We'll definitely be hitting up another one soon. We've got two new ones coming in Tennessee and Kentucky, and we'll hit those ones up as well. And next time I'm in the DFW area, which I will be, we'll hit up the other ones that I've missed. Anyway, thanks for watching, everybody. Take care and stay awesome. And have a Bucky's delicious day. Bye.